Right, Shalom. First, I'd like to give all praises unto Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, and double honors unto the apostles and the elders at Great Millstone, and honor to you brothers out there on the highways and the byways, teaching this word in all sincerity and in truth. And um, <laughs> there's a statement uh, known as the horde of, of, of zombies. And um, that's basically what what uh, uh, the 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 carnival is all about. Notting Hill Carnival is yet another uh, um, path that the hordes of the wicked they take happily, celebratory, because they lack understanding. They actually celebrate walking in the ways of evil, in the ways of death. In which death is going to be the only reward for them when all said and done. All right, these people they lack understanding, they don't understand that the, the, the paths that they have chosen in life lead onto desolation and punishment. All right, so these dead people, these people of zero understanding, all right, the two thirds of our people, the so called black man so-called uh, black woman, two-third of the so-called Hispanic men, Hispanic women, two-third of our people, they're going to remain in this congregation and congregations like this. And you will see them flock in their millions and their thousands to these events which are for dead people, celebrating their own demise. It is for us to separate ourselves through Yahweh Shai from death Onto life. So let's get some precepts back. Because I saw these hordes man. These hordes of heathen. <laughs> these hordes of zombies. Uh, and it ain't pretty. And you know. A normal person would look at that. They won't see nothing wrong. Because they lack understanding. Alright. But we who have received life. And received the, the understanding of the scriptures. We, we look at these people. And we say, damn, these people are, are, are walking in the way of death. And they don't even know it, man. They don't even understand it. Because they know not the scriptures, man. Proverbs 21 and 16. The man that wandereth out of the way of understanding shall remain in the congregation of the dead. Right? Point blank and period. And that's... that's um. Two third of our people, they're going to remain in the congregation of the dead. Now the elect are going to move from death unto life through the, the, the wisdom and the understanding which is given through Yahweh Shai. To understand what is right and what is wrong. And to exercise themselves in the ways of the scriptures, in the way of Yahweh Shai. The way of truth which leadeth unto life. Yahweh Shai himself said, I am the way. All right. This is John 14 and 6. Yahweh Shai saith unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. And you ain't going to see hordes of niggas and hoes celebrating and running into the way of Yahweh Shai. It doesn't work like that. You see them celebrating and running into the way of the carnival and these clubs and but you ain't gonna see them celebrating and, and running into the way of Yahweh Shai, man. Because this ain't for the majority. And this ain't for the proud. This is for the meek. Alright, Yahweh Shai saith unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. And life cometh from the Father. And you see, the whole world is gonna understand because. Two third of our people, they they follow many paths, right? They follow many paths, and there are many paths, but there's only one path which leads onto life, and every single one of them paths is gonna is gonna uh, manifest itself. Any path outside of Yahweh Shai is gonna manifest itself in his last days. That that path ends in death, and two third of our people are gonna be an example of that. Whether they, whether they be Muslim, whether they be Christian, or there's just these run-in-the-mill demons running around, uh, trapping, and all this stuff. 
all these paths and these ways which are in rebellion and which are contrary to the holy scriptures man are going to come to naught and those that follow it are going to come to naught even though they're, they're, they're celebrating on the way to that end the celebrations are going to be cut short okay this is a joke all right when I saw the people today, man, the amount of people that was flocking up on them trains, man, piling themselves into them trains to go to this carnival madness that that the people have got to board up their houses from. That's how that's how that's how de de degraded and and decadent it is. People have to board up their houses, and the police have to be there with metal detectors to stop you people from killing each other. <laughs> and you you want to take your children there? People all on drugs and the whores everywhere, just naked, butt naked. And that's that's fun. That's that's a joke. That's acceptable. <laughs> We're gonna find out, man. See, the, see, a, a lesson is gonna be learned, man, in these last days. A lesson is gonna be learned. The truth of these scriptures are gonna be reinforced and manifested. And for some, it's gonna be an easy lesson. And for some, it's going to be a hard lesson, meaning you're going to be made an example of. This is Matthew 7 and 13 says, Enter ye in at the straight gate. For wide is the gate and broad is the way that leadeth to destruction. And many there be which go in thereat. And guess who the, who the ones that's going to be marching through them wide gates? The zombies. Just like how they were marching their way in their, in their hordes to this carnival bullshit, which is completely in the spirit of wickedness, the spirit of, of, of pride, the spirit of whoredom. All right? Absolute wickedness. Yeah? Disgusting, offensive. And these people revel in that which is offensive to Yahweh Shami 